All right, so we got Call of Duty Black Ops 6 Global Launch Gameplay Trailers. Here's the video. Let's go, man. Here we go. The Cold War is over. My guess is that they're planning a spectacle of some kind. Uh-oh. I'm going scare the hell out of people. Coalition forces launched the operation two weeks ago against Saddam Hussein. They're taking out as many strategic targets from the air as possible. Do it. Station weapon free. Some biological weapons. Yes, sir. And they put this in Saddam's hands, too. Isn't that your friend? Turn it off! The nature of our enemy is unclear now. We're not alone. They would kill each one of you given the open shot. Yo, we're gonna be driving a tank? Time we had a check. Uh oh. Pre order the vault edition now. Yo, I thought I saw a fly. Oh my god, I had to smack that thing. I haven't seen a fly in 20 years. All right, now listen. Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Um, now, obviously, this is mainly about the campaign and stuff like that. Um, let, let me first of all, before I even talk about the campaign, let, let's see what the Vault Edition gives us. Give me one second. Hunters versus, okay, that's a whatever. Black Cell, okay, uh, whatever. Gumpo, okay. Gobble Gum, okay, we might need that. Woods Operation Packs, so like some wood skins, okay. Get some of these guns. The Jackal, bro, the Jackal Power, whatever, that gun is absolutely, bro, it's nasty, bro. The Marine SP, uh, okay, the L, bro, the LR Sniper is nasty. Uh, the AMES 85, okay, never tried that gun before. And then we got the Combat Knife. Listen, Call of Duty Black Ops 6 literally drops later this month on the 25th. Um, listen, I'm getting my copy. Hopefully, you guys are getting your copy as well, man. I'm super excited. Uh, first of all, Let's get, I'm going to talk about the campaign a little later. Let's talk about the multiplayer. Brother, the multiplayer blew me away. And, what, and the reason it blew me away is because, and, and you know, man, maybe it's just like my expectations are like super low or whatever, bro. But like, like whenever I played the beta for like three days straight, I can't lie to you, bro. I had so much fun playing the beta. Yes, it was cheesy or whatever. And yes, like, you know, people are sweaty. But bro, that, you know, bro, bro, people play Call of Duty every single, like every single year. People get better every single year. So what you have to expect is you have to expect the competition to get better and better and better. And that's just what it is, you know. Now, obviously, back then when I was like eight years old and I was like, you know, like, bro, I was dropping 30 and 40 kills and stuff like that. Bro, we all did. OK, let's not act like, you know, I'm not a pro or nothing. Like we all used to drop like 20, 30, 40 kills on these dads coming home from work. Like we all used to do that. So, um, you know, now that, you know, we got these little kids, you know, playing Call of Duty now. And obviously I'm playing Call of Duty. I'm still playing Call of Duty. So, of course, you know, I got some experience on my belt. Bro, I feel like LeBron out here, bro. Like, listen, I've been playing Call of Duty for so long, bro. Like, bro, I feel like a veteran right now. Um, but <laughs> I said a veteran, not a pro. But, yeah, um, but you know, playing Call of Duty for so long, you know, the competition is, is naturally going to rise up. So, um, you know, the sweats and, and, and all of, like, the like the techie, just, just sweaty people, that was expected. So, then that, that didn't, it bothered me, but, like, it, it didn't bother me, like, gameplay-wise. Gameplay-wise... Uh, I will admit, I'll admit, uh, it was nice. It was nice and it was fast. It was more uh, of like a Black Ops speed, you know, which makes sense because it's a Black Ops game. Um, I don't know what it is, but like whenever it comes to like just overall game, I do like Modern Warfare better. And maybe that's just me just growing up, just being like a Modern Warfare kid, whatever. I did play Black Ops when I was younger, but I was more of a Modern, uh, Modern Warfare kid. But um, but yeah, Black Ops style, I definitely fits the, um, I, I fit the Black Ops style way more. And so uh, playing Black Ops 6, um, we call it beta, bro. Oh, man. bro, I had so much fun. It was nasty. I actually uploaded a video of me playing uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 6. I think I dropped around, what, hmm, 60, 70, maybe 80 kills, like like I'm scum back in the day. Um, you know, any Call of Duty team, so you guys, uh, you know, hit me up. Um, but, yeah, you know, I was playing, <laughs> I was playing some multiplayer. Oh, uh, yeah, well, like I said, it, it was definitely sweaty, but it was, it was very fun. It was fast. That little uh, Omni movement thing. That Omni movement thing, I didn't really try the whole, like, you know, jump back and shoot thing. I didn't really try that. Um, I feel like that's, like, usually, like, a, I don't know, bro. Like, the Omni movement thing, it's going to be so weird for me to do because I've been playing Call of Duty for so long that whenever I do try to, like, you know, jump back or whatever um, in, like, Call of Duty, it feels weird because in, like, the older Call of Duty, when you try to jump back, you couldn't really, like, you know, like, 
you couldn't really, like, do too much with that. Or if you try to, like, you know, move while you're on the ground, it'll be, like, prone lock. But basically, when you don't have any prone lock and you can, and when you can jump back and stuff like that, it's weird doing it now because you weren't allowed to do it for, like, 10-plus years. So it, I, I got to get used to that if, I, if I'm being honest with you. But uh, the movement's great. The guns, oh, my goodness gracious. Let me tell you something, bro. Uh, the Jackal Pow is good. There was another, oh, my God. Wait, hold up. What gun did I use in the beta? What gun did I, well, I, I got to, oh, my goodness. Bro, it's been, like, weeks since I played the beta. What guns have I used in the beta? I've used the, um, oh my God, it's tip of my tongue. It's literally at the tip. Bro, what gun did I use in the beta? Oh my God. No, no, no. It, the Jackal Pow, I did use that gun. There was another gun that I was, that I was using. I used the AK. Bro, what was the other gun? No, hold up. Give me one second. No, 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 no. We're not going to do this. I was literally using that gun. I, I'm looking it up right now. How did I forget? Oh my goodness gracious. All right, give me one second. Black Ops 6 beta guns. I literally forgot because I was using the Jackal Pow. I was also using the, uh, what do you call it? Like the, um, the AK. I was using like the LR Sniper. Um, and there was like another gun that everybody was using. Bro, what is it? Uh, Call of Duty. Give me one second, y'all. Call of Duty Black Ops 6 Beta Guns. Beta Guns. What, 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 what was the weapons? What was the weapons? Give me one second. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I got to verify this. Give me one second, y'all. Sorry about that. I know I'm wasting time right now. XM4. No, 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 no. The 9mm, that was that was like a that was like a handgun. Uh, what's bro? Where where is it? Uh, uh um um uh, oh, the C9. Bro, I was using the C9, bro. I was maining the C9. I was maining the uh the AK. I was maining the Jackal. Like, bro, those guns are absolutely cracked. Obviously, you know, they're adding in, like, you know, if you played the beta, you know, they, I think they gave us, like, what, three or four guns in, like, each column. So, then they gave us, like, every single gun. But uh, it was definitely a blast, you know, playing multiplayer and stuff like that. Again, it, you know, the sweats, you know, I, I wanted to hit my head against the table. YouTube, I'm joking, by the way. Um, but, yeah, like, you know, the sweats are the sweats. It is what it is. It's the competition. It, you know, you can't really change that. All right, let's talk about the campaign. Now, the campaign, man, super excited about it. The campaign gives off, like, a conspiracy theory type of uh, vibe to it with, you know, you having to deal with, like, bro, first of all, we got Adler. <sighs> we got Adler coming back. I never liked Adler to begin with. I mean, I, I, he just looks weird. Um, <laughs> I know that's a horrible excuse for not liking somebody, but, like, like I like generally, bro, like, he looks like a bad guy. Like, I, I, I legit don't like him. Um, other than that, we got Woods coming back in the campaign. So I did hear that Black Ops 6 was actually supposed to take um, it was supposed to take place after Black Ops 2, which is crazy. I did not know that. I actually had, uh, had to learn that. So um, turns out it's going to have to do with like a lot of like undercover sneaking in. And it's more like open world. It, it, I think Call of Duty is like literally letting you have the option to like take whatever approach you want to uh, like like you want to have. So like you, you're able to like. Um, steal people's like uh, like pickpocket people without them noticing you're able to you know um, like drug people and stuff like that and take them into the room and steal their clothes it's kind of like some mission impossible type stuff but other than that man um, the black ops 6 campaign definitely looks more like a conspiracy theory and it looks like it has like a, a lot of like twists and turns which i'm really excited about so we'll definitely see on the 25th if you guys actually don't know um there won't be like any like multiplayer like early access or whatever. Even if you buy like the ultimate edition or whatever, you will have to like literally you have to legit wait until um what do you call it like October twenty fifth. Like there's no early access or nothing. Um yeah, you gotta wait just like everybody else. I mean, what's to be fair, Call of Duty has always rolled out like the multi like you get to play like the campaign or you get to play like the multiplayer like a week early if you got like the like the ultimate edition or whatever. Turns out, nah, bro. Everybody's waiting for the, like you have to wait until the twenty fifth to actually play a game. So we'll see how it is. Um Call of Duty Black Ops Six, in my opinion, is definitely a uh, I don't wanna say it's like a make or break situation for Call of Duty, but like if I'm being completely honest with you, bro, Call of Duty Modern Warfare two Whenever it came down to like the uh to like the multiplayer, the multiplayer was a little iffy. And when I say multi, uh, Modern Warfare Two, I mean like the recent Modern Warfare Two, like 2022 Modern Warfare Two. Um, like the hype up for that game was was huge or whatever. And then like you know a lot of people, I think a lot of people played like the multiplayer. They couldn't really deal with it. Um, the Warzone was definitely the worst in 2022. Like I, it was just, it lacked content. Um, the TTK was absolutely unreal. The weapons were eh. 
Um, that was a year where like the camos were, were were not really that good because I mean I think like the ultimate camo was like gold or whatever. They tried to like take it back to the old days and do that. Um, and, and so I don't think a lot of people enjoy Modern Warfare Two. Uh, Modern Warfare Three, um, the campaign was like two minutes long, um, and that was like the whole big joke around Call of Duty's campaign. So if I'm being honest with you, a lot of people don't really trust like the campaign now, but. If I'm being, you know, listen, I got high hopes for this Call of Duty. I think this is, listen, if they can really do really good on this Call of Duty, bro, this can definitely bring back a lot of people uh, that definitely don't really play Call of Duty anymore. Because, you know, if I'm being honest, I, I don't think, I don't think everybody trusts Call of Duty anymore. Um, some people do. Obviously, Call of Duty fans, they're going to play the game or whatever. Um, I'm considered like a Call of Duty fan. I'm not going to sit here and be fake. Uh, but I, I have, like, I'm not going to sit here and act like every Call of Duty was great. No, it wasn't. Um, so let's just see. How Call of Duty Black Ops 6 is. The multiplayer is already good uh, for me. Want to see how the campaign is. Want to check out the campaign. And um, other than that, man, comment down below, man. What are you guys excited for for Call of Duty Black Ops 6? Whether it's the campaign, zombies. Oh, bro, I almost forget about the zombies. The campaign, zombies, multiplayer, whatever. And, um, yeah, I'll be sure to read you guys' comments uh, later today in this video. See you guys next time out.